channel. So for today, we're going to be going over my monthly BoxyCharm box. BoxyCharm is a monthly subscription where it costs 21 bucks a month and you get four to five full size products in here. And the theme of this month's box is totally. So if you'd like to see what I got in my box this month, then just keep watching. First thing that I got in this box that I'm going to go over is this. Wander Beauty Glow Ahead Illuminating Face Oil. So we have gotten a few Wander Beauty products in the past. This one retails for $42. It says this multitasking beauty elixir instantly hydrates and absorbs into the skin, revealing a bouncy, youthful complexion, no matter what skin type you have. The lightweight, powerful formula nourishes and primes the skin to help to restore skin's moisture barrier while providing a youthful glow. The spill proof dropper allows you to use it one drop at a time. That sounds pretty cool. Um, I've actually never used an oil before, so I'm interested to see how this is. Oh, it's pink. It's like a pink oil. Let's do, see how this goes. Oh yeah, it is pink. That's cool. Just gonna rub it in. It feels really nice. Oh, like, like I said, I've never used oils, but I feel like an oil would tend to make you look and feel greasy, but this doesn't feel greasy like at all. It doesn't have a super strong scent, which is good. I'm not a big fan of overly fragranced base products really soaked into the skin it actually feels pretty nice so I won't have to continue to use this just to see like if it makes a difference or whatnot but actually right now I'm gonna quickly put my foundation on and the concealer and then while we'll be back to the next product all right guys so I'm back I did my foundation concealer put some lipstick on curled my lashes so the next thing that we're going to jump into is probably the thing I was most excited about with this box, and that is the Becca Hydra Mist Refresh Powder. So this retails for $39, and it says this weightless powder sets and refreshes makeup for a silky, smooth, invisible finish. Formulated with 50% water and glycerin, this powder creates a mist-like sensation on the skin for a seamless finish and comfortable feel. So I've seen a lot of mixed reviews on this. I saw a review Kathleen Life sit on it and she really liked this. I saw Manny, Manny MUA, I know he doesn't like this. So I'm just curious to see. Um, if you have dry skin, I'm sure this is something that you're going to love, but I'm really curious as to see how this feels. And it has a little cap on it says, keep me close to keep cool. So I'm gonna open that up. And then there's like another little seal in here. It does look like a lot kind of like spilled through. Oh yeah, a lot spilled through. So I actually just want to feel it. Oh my gosh. That's like the weirdest texture ever. And I know I look really weird because I look really pale. Oh my word, it is really cool. All right, so I think I'm going to go in with a brush. And I'm just going to and it has this really neat like mesh sifter on it so let's see how this goes oh my word that feels so weird it's, my, it's like it feels like your brush is wet but it's the pot oh no mm -mm. it that just took off my makeup let's try it with a sponge I don't know man this is gonna take my makeup off. It's not gonna be a fan. Okay, so I don't know if it was the brush. See, no, it's taking off makeup on this side too. Do y'all see that? You see that redness over here and here? Huh, let's keep going, see if we can. This is like the most awesome feeling powder Oh my word, it feels so good. I definitely think the sponge goes over better than the brush I was using. But this feels 
so, so good. Like, it's like wet. That feels so good. Okay, so next, I'm actually gonna go ahead really quickly, bronze my face, put some highlighter on, and a little bit of blush, um, and then we will move to the next thing. Next thing that we have in this box is the Ace Beauty Glimmer, Glimmer Shadow Duo. It says, high pigmented soft shadows with a creamy texture, especially designed for the ultimate color payoff. These shadows provide bold color in one swipe without fallout creasing or fading. And these two both retail for $25. So we have two shades. We have French Vanilla. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch these for you too. And they look identical to like the ColourPop one. So this is the one that we're getting and this is the ColourPop. But even when you open it, they have like that same kind of texture looking thing. They're like the same size and everything too. And the color pops or arts like a lot cheaper. So we'll see. So this one, as I said, is French vanilla. It's soft, but it's definitely not as soft as color pop. And that's that. It's like a really silvery shade, really pretty. Probably is not showing up too great. And then the next one that we have is Huckleberry. So let's check this one. That's really pretty too. So what I did do is I went ahead and already threw like a bronzer color in my crease. So I'm going to go in with the Huckleberry color and I'm just going to tap that all over my lid. And then I'm going to blend this out really quick. And then the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm gonna take the French Vanilla shade and I'm gonna take a small brush, I'm gonna pack this on, and then I'm gonna throw this in my inner corner and then kind of a little bit on the lid. A really pretty silvery color. All right, so there's that. And I'm actually gonna do the same thing on this side and I'll be right back. All right guys, so the next thing that we have is something that I already know I'm probably not going to like or ever use again after this video. And that is a Hollywood and Vine Velvety Touch Smooth Cool Liner. Reason being is it's a pencil and I'm not a big fan of pencil liners. This says, line your eyes with the rich intensity of velvety touch smooth cold liner. The creamy formula glides on smooth and adds drama to any desired look. This retails for $7. So let's do like a little swatch through so we can see. Okay, it is pigmented, I will give it that, but it's like it's already smudged. <laughs> and running and like I didn't do anything. So I'm just gonna run this along the waterline. We'll see how this does. Oh. That's very black, yeah. But it's super pointy. Yeah, okay. I don't like this. <laughs> Ooh, my eyes are watering. Okay guys, last thing we have in here was another thing that I was super excited about, and that is the Tarte Big Ego Mascara. And this is an ultra black vegan mascara that lifts your lashes and delivers a fully loaded flutter for up to 16 hours. And this retails for $23. So like I said, I am excited about this but I was hoping I would have gotten like they had like another facial serum or something just because I have recently got two new mascaras so I didn't necessarily need another one but look how cute this is like that's cute I want to see the wand on here that is a big wand 
So let's go ahead. I'm going to scoot right up so you guys can see me put this on. I'm trying not to make like any faces. So that is just one coat and there's without. It looks really good. I mean, I wouldn't say it's like super different from the other mascaras that I have, but it is really pretty. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and do this other eye and I'll be right back. I went ahead and added two coats of the mascara and I think it's really pretty. Um, one thing I forgot to mention was on your little sheet right here, it has a little heart down here and it tells you which variation this is. So I got variation 12. Also, my box this month totaled up to $136, which is an awesome value for the fact that you're only paying, you know, 21 bucks plus tax. So yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed this little unboxing. Make sure to go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you're not already and give this video a like and I'll see you at my next video.